a post once you have already um, published it. Sometimes you do want to go back and make edits again. So what I'm going to do here is I'm going to open up the post. I'm in our dashboard posts. I go to Tea Time in the Orient with Art and Echo. And then I click on it and I go to Edit. <clears throat> and it opens up here. So one of the things I wanted to do was add more tags. I um, couldn't really think of a tags at the right time, but I called Holly and she gave me some more ideas. So we're going to add some more tags to this. But rather than just randomly putting them in, we're going to go over here under Posts to Tags first. And we're going to add the tags there. So at this time, this is the only tag we have. Vertigree or Vertigris Embossing Powder. I'm going to add this tag, Tea Time in the Orient, because the stamp, it's, the uh, card was made using that particular uh, tag. And so we're going to click Add, I mean, using that stamp sheet from Art and Echo. So we now have Tea Time in the Orient added as a tag. And remember, tags are like index indexes and books, so uh, it also uses a medallion stamp. This will be a tag. I will not do this medallions plural, just medallions singular. And when one of you as a, as a designer uses another um, a medallion or creates a stamp, a card using a medallion, you can come in here and just select the medallion um, as your tag on that. Another one Holly suggested was embossing powder. Again, singular embossing powder, not embossing powders. And the final one that she suggested is pagoda. Okay, so these are going to be the tags for this particular a blog post, but again, you guys can use them again and again. Uh, you can also come in here to add new ones. Let's go back to our posts. And we got Tea Time in the Orient right here. Edit. And all I'm going to do first is go down to Tags. And I'm going to choose the most used tags. We have Vertigris and Boston Powder is the only one we've used so far. So I'm going to write in here Tea Time. And look, it pops right up. I click it and add it. And then I'm going to write Medallion. And look, it pops right up. Click it, add it. And then I'm going to write Embossing Powder. Before you add a new tag, use the ones that are already there, unless there's something that hasn't been covered. And then Pagoda. Let's see. Pagoda. P A G O D A. Yeah, try to spell things correctly. That's always helpful. Okay, so we have now have tags for this particular post. The other thing I'm going to do is, tr is try to edit this. I didn't really like how this, uh, this uh, caption went to a second line. So I'm going to edit this image, click on it, go to the edit button, which is a pencil. And I am just going to eliminate Holly Brown right here. So it doesn't tea time in the Orient um, stamp collection. I think that's a better name uh, because I know then what it came from. We're going to click here. I'm going to just go ahead and update this because we can do that right now. It will not publish on Facebook again. Once it's published on Facebook, the first time you hit publish, that's when it publishes. It won't do it again, but it will look different. So um, it will take our edits anyway. Let's go to view post. And let's scroll up here. And you see how this is now 
uh, all in one line. I preferred that in this. And we still have Holly Brown's name down here. And the other thing, if you look here, look at all the tags. Nice little tag, embossing, medallion, pagoda, etc. So all those tags are now part of this blog post. Um, I think that's enough for right now. I, and that was it. So you guys have a great day.